now it's 11 a.m. and uh, we have waked up to a very stormy night today uh, morning because it is windy and it's wet and it's cloudy and it's just absolutely bad weather and the tent is just shaking here in the uh, in Norway and uh, daddy is cooking some bacon to our breakfast so today it's gonna be breakfast with bacon sandwich that was a windy wet morning we managed to get the tent packed away even though we just broke a pole it's not so good I have to fix it later we have the, about 20 kilometers with headwind so now we're all cold let's see if we can get there and find a place to go on a nice warm show According to the weather forecast, it shouldn't even be raining now. This is what they call no rain up here in the north of Norway. <laughs> Just sideways is coming in now, this fine rain, wind, headwind today. So we only have 20 kilometers to do where we have a strong headwind and rain. Get the bikes moving here because push them around the corner. Actually, it's the windiest we've uh, sighted for a long time since Iceland, but this time it's raining at the same time. Okay, now we just had the uh, windiest, wettest 20 kilometers probably a long time. Oh, <laughs> and uh, we got blown off the bikes. What well, I got blown off twice. How many times did you get blown off? and ride down once, fell all the way down the Good job, luckily I'm dressed. Yeah, and we had to push a few times, but uh, we got here, now we're in a coffee shop, nice and warm. We just booked a, um, an apartment for this evening so we can get everything dried out, which now we're completely soaked. And all the hotels here booked, and we're so lucky to find an apartment, of course. We just want to get in the dry now and dry up because our tent is wet, our tent home. Oh, it's broken and our clothes is wet and our feet are soaked and everything so I just really want to get inside now. Enough for a sale for today. So just had a cup of coffee in here. <laughs> just to get warm again and trying to find a place to stay and we managed to find an apartment this evening. Try the place here. Yeah. Okay, we got this nice warm dry Apartment. Perfect. Have a nice room here. And, uh, getting the bags in. Get sorted out. <laughs> and then find a, what's it called? Yeah. Whatever, otherwise we can dry our clothes. Yeah. Get everything dry. We've just got wet clothes. And we've got uh, a nice place to stay here. We can go in a warm shower. Hey folks, they've got an uh, exercise bike here, if anybody wants a bit of exercise. Okay, we are now nice and dry. I've been in the shower uh, for about 30 minutes. Med has been in the shower how many times? Twice, just Twice. to enjoy it. <laughs> What's Jamie been doing? He's also been in the shower. Yes, and, and been resting. And yeah. sleeping. In a so. nice warm dry bed. Yeah, so that was nice. This was this place was available. That was lucky. Otherwise we'll be in the tent again. Uh, really grateful. So we are out of the wild and into civilization. <laughs> <laughs> so we've taken over the place. Everything is hanging everywhere. Sleeping bags, all our clothes. So uh, we can get dry again. Now we are going out for something to eat. See if we can find some fish and chips. Mm -hmm. See if they're better here than Husavik. You still think they're the best ones, Jeremy, Husavik? Uh, I don't know. That's a, that's an ice on what they're talking about. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure we had our favourite fish and chips ever. We'll see what they're like here. We find a region to find. In another whale watching town. Now this town. This is a popular place for whale watching. It's a bit of a town like Husavik in Iceland. Now, just show you what there is on the menu for today. 
over here you actually can get whale beef a beef with whale a steak. whale steak and on the right side of the menu you can actually have fish and chips so like reindeer steak as well and reindeer reindeer steak mm -hmm. but it's all like cyclists happy yes Actually here in this restaurant they also like think it's Christmas still because there is Christmas lights in the and the Christmas tree they have decorations they have put up in the top of the roof here so it's like a bit of like a feel like it's Christmas so last time we sat in this restaurant a few hours ago we were all wet and cold <laughs> now we're uh, have clean clothes on dry clothes and uh, Ready to uh, have a nice night. Can we smell better? Here in this restaurant, uh, there's whale steak and it's um, it is um, mushrooms, broccoli, mashed potato, onions, and some tranebear and some whale steak. It's maybe not so good for the whales. We just kill them. It's very incredible animal, but um, I'm just need to try it because we are going very far and must be some Norwegian food to eat whale steak. And I have reindeer steak. I'm gonna try that. Yeah. And daddy just have a full English <laughs> fish and chips. Fish and chips. <laughs> daddy feels like he's home in England. I've when been looking can, forward to this in the when winter. When he cannot go to maybe England, he's just having it in Norway. It's very good. First time you're eating well, mate. Yes. Do you want to taste? Mmm. Okay. It's like, it looks like beef. You can just see it here. If you can see it on my plate. It looks like beef. Uh, the first bit when you cut it, it's a bit hard. But in the middle, it's very soft. Huh? This is our nice warm house for this evening. Okay, so today we managed to cycle uh, the last, I think it was 22 kilometers through the storm and into the dry here in Andenes. So uh, I think we're going to stay here tomorrow and all uh, dry out, have a rest, have a nice long breakfast. And then we'll be taking the ferry over to the island of Senya on Saturday morning. At the moment, if the weather forecast uh, lasts it looks like it's uh, going to be sunny from saturday so we're hoping for that we can have uh, three last days on the bike as we head towards uh, tromsu so okay we're going to have a rest here tomorrow dry out and we will see you back on the bikes on saturday